We can make anything fly. It's a matter of getting it safe uh, and how long it's going to last. I mean, you know, we can get them to fly maybe six months, and then you got to tear them down. But every year they got to be torn down, no matter what. But some of them, every flight, you got to go back through them maintenance-wise and get them safe to fly again. And some of them can go for six months. Um, so pretty much everything we can get to fly, as long as we can, uh, you know, they want to put the money in them to, to get them right. <laughs> We restore old World War II airplanes, mostly uh, uh, to flying condition so we can demonstrate them to people so they can see what World War II was all about. Uh, it's basically just your, uh, the precision of the quality you do it. I mean, that's your satisfaction. You know, your personal precision and quality into the, into the job. And besides that, Besides rock and roll, it's all I know how to do. Some of them are, uh, you know, in, in flying conditions in different areas. We have to dismantle them and ship them here, and then we go through them and uh, make them safer for flight today. And other ones are, we have to totally disassemble them, redo everything, uh, like the Wildcats you see out there. Okay. All the hoses and cables and everything's all been redone, and uh, and that's basically you go back so it it's, looks original, but it's all new stuff. My best airplane is the Corsair. That's my uh, that's my airplane. We restored it in this shop, so we're proud of that one. So uh, yeah, the Corsair is my favorite airplane. Mm -hmm. uh, that one in the Mustangs number two, American made airplanes. <laughs> Mr. Yegan is a local gentleman. He got his love of aviation because his dad was involved as a pilot in the Berlin airlift uh, after World War II. He is the owner and founder of Aviation Institute of Maintenance, and he owns the museum and he owns all the aircraft in it. Gentleman that's in charge of or owns this whole thing. You know, he usually buys them and then, uh, we restore them, and then I mean, they display, be, they're displayed in the museum over in Virginia. Beach.